Greetings fellow humans. I wanted to make a YouTube video today because I just seen the coolest post ever and I just want to do it in real life but I need to like share it with everyone so that we can actually make it proper and like occur actually. I'll read it to you guys and um, then I'm going to tell you like hopefully what I'm going to do and then maybe some of you guys will do it too. So it says, you know how people buy drinks for girls in bars, why can't people do that in bookstores? Like if I'm looking at a novel, a, no a novel in Barnes and Noble and some person walks up to me and strikes up a conversation and offers to buy the book for me, there's a lot better chance of that working out in their favor. And then it says, I'm going to reblog this until it's a cultural norm. And like the reverse too, so like girls buying drinks for guys. That isn't my thing. I always buy my own drinks when I go out. But um, I just think that that is the coolest thing ever because I am the biggest bookworm. And if somebody came up to me in the store and was like, Ah, oh, I see you're reading this book um, here. And uh, yeah, um, I I like that book too. Or I don't know. I don't know what you would say. That's my problem. I'm going to have to get over the social awkward situation before that I can actually do this. Um, but we'll see. Um, maybe I'll just like sneak up and find out what book they're looking at. And if they seem like they're really interested in it and they put it back, I'll like buy it when they leave the store and rub it up to them and be like, look, here's a book. You're cute. But um, yeah, no, in, in all seriousness now, I think this is a super cool idea and I actually want to do it and I'm gonna um, try it. I don't, I don't live in the U USA, so I don't think, we don't have a Barnes & Noble where I live, but we have Chapters and Coles and Indigo, so I'm going to go to those stores and creep on some people. It might not even just, maybe not even like a guy or a girl, like it could be a like guy or girl. I'm just going to like buy someone a book and be like, hey, here's this book. Hope you have an awesome day, and then maybe we'll be friends, even if it's a girl. Um, but yeah. I'm gonna do it and you should do it too just buy someone a book that they look really interested in and go up to them and give it to them and I just feel like this will just potentiate so much happiness and we should all do it um, I'm gonna do it and then I'm gonna take a picture with the person that I bought the book for and then I'm gonna post it on my Twitter so my Twitter is the same as my YouTube account name bring on the chaos but I'll put a link to that in the description and then you can follow me if you want to see my random stranger book buying experience photo. Um, other than that, I just thought that was really cool and I actually want to do it. But I have another thing to talk about today. I want to talk about a book that I actually just bought um, not too long ago. And it was super cheap. It was $5. What a deal. Um, but it's just super good for... Like, you have to sit down and think about it a little bit, but it's actually presented in a good way. Um, it's called The Big... Like, it's a series, and it's called The Big Questions. And this one is the ethics one, and this one's written by Julian Baghini. I'll, maybe that's pronounced wrong. But, um, yeah, and they have one about the mind and, I think, religion. I only got this one, but I'm probably going to go back and get the other ones. Um, there's, like, a bunch of topics going on in here, and he just, like, lays out some of the philosophy about it and like the ethics and like just the big question like big question so I'll read you some of them here it says are we responsible for our actions um what is a just war uh what can science tell us about morality are drug laws morally inconsistent is morality relative do animals have rights um I haven't read those ones yet let's see which I have I read one that was I just thought was really interesting. It's called Is There a Golden Rule? And it was really cool. I thought initially I'm like, I love the golden rule. How could like we say the golden rule sucks cuz I want everyone to treat me how I want to be treated, but or treat others how you think that you'd want to be treated or how you think they would want to be treated if they are treating you. Blah blah blah. It's like but he like brings in like how do we know if how you want to be treated is how someone else wants to be treated or like he brings in like ne like needs and stuff I don't know I can't present it as good as him so I thought you should go and get this from your nearest bookstore I'll put close up so you can see how wonderful it is um and it's hardcover too and it was five dollars it says 
oh, it's by, I don't know how to pronounce this, Quirkus Philosophy, I don't, I, mean, I don't even know, but anyways, it says, oh, you can get it from www.quercusbooks.co.uk, anyways, I'll put a link down there about this too, so you need to go get this book, and then you need to go to a bookstore and creep on someone who looks like they're really contemplating getting a book and then buy it for them and then take a picture with them and then tweet the picture at me and let me know how it goes and let me know if you made any new friendships or maybe you got a date I don't know um, or let me know how that goes in the comments below or tweet at me okay goodbye fellow humans